Welcome to QuartzComponents.com LPG gas leakage detector using MQ2 sensor and controller using SG90 servo and Arduino. Introduction This is a simple project with one sensor used to detect the gas leakage and one motor used to indicate the control. The microcontroller used is of course the simplest Arduino Uno. In this project, we will see how to use MQ2 sensor and how to control SG90 servo motor and also to use a buzzer and an LED to ring an alarm and indicate the gas leak using the LED. Components required Arduino Uno, MQ2 gas sensor module, SG90 servo motor, buzzer 5 volt, LED with current limiting resistor, breadboard and jumper wires. Circuit connections Connect the 5 volt pin of Arduino to VCC pin of MQ2 sensor and also to red wire of servo. Connect ground pin of Arduino to servo black wire, ground pin of MQ2 sensor, negative lead of LED through a current limiting resistor and to negative lead of buzzer. Connect positive lead of buzzer to pin 12 of Arduino. Connect the positive lead of LED to pin 11 of Arduino. Connect the control pin of servo which is orange wire to pin 8 of Arduino and finally connect pin A0 of Arduino to A0 of MQ2 sensor. Code explanation part. First we include the servo motor header file. Then all the pins A0, 11 and 12 are initialized. A float point is used to store the sensor value. In the void setup we declare which pins are output. For example buzzer LED are output whereas the smoke detector pin A0 should be input. Then we initialize serial monitor and set the baud rate to 9600. Then we display few text on the serial monitor. In void loop we use the function analog read to check the status of the A0 pin that is the smoke detector. If the detected smoke is above a certain threshold as we have written in our code as 600 then a part of the code is executed, else another part of the code is executed. When the value is above 600, it is considered to be smoke detected. Then the buzzer is rung high, the LED is written to be high and the servo is asked to rotate for 90 degrees. A delay of 1 millisecond is created. When the smoke is not detected, the buzzer state shall remain low, the LED state shall remain low and servo is set to be at 0 degrees and a delay of 1 millisecond is created. Conclusion This is a fun to build yet simple project. Its simplicity enables beginners to engage and learn this project without fretting. It also teaches beginners how to use a sensor and an actuator. Thank you.